KANYE West made yet another wild bid to stage a live show and was given exactly the same answer. The U.S. Sun has already reported that the controversial rapper's recent attempts to organize concerts in Europe, South America, the Middle East, and Asia have all ended in failure. Insiders even claim he's trying to buy land to stage his own festival. And now, according to two well-placed sources, he has been advised to abandon ridiculously ambitious plans to perform at all seven wonders of the world site, such as the Great Wall of China and India's Taj Mahal. Massive offer. The 46-year-old, who has faced widespread criticism and lost sponsorships following an online rant about Jesus and Hitler, was reportedly prepared to offer up to $6 million to secure these locations, say the insiders. However, UNESCO, the governing body that protect the prestigious sites, and various cultural agencies swiftly rejected these insane proposals, with one individual who has worked for over 15 years in managing and conserving world heritage sites deeming the offers impossible to accept. Can I, whose new album Vultures won soared to the top of the charts despite ongoing controversies, harbored grandiose ideas of mesmerizing crowds at iconic sites such as Chichen Itza, Petra, Christ the Redeemer, Taj Mahal, Colosseum, Great Wall of China, Machu Picchu, and Giza Pyramids. However, his team was promptly informed that such plans were impossible to execute, leaving some officials at these sites questioning whether the entire proposition was merely a joke. Meanwhile, the continuous stream of bizarre snapshots featuring his wife, Bianca Sensori, and her eccentric wardrobe choices hasn't helped thaw relations or repair the damage done to his credibility. Reputation crushed. It's not just about his reputation, it's also about the sanctity of these places, confirmed one of the sources a music industry veteran with extensive experience in international venue management and artist promotion. But certainly, his reputation doesn't aid matters. You want to associate with him, given that some of his values clash starkly with the values associated with these locations. It's too controversial. Can I had hoped to emulate the Rolling Stones, who famously performed to over a million people on Rio's iconic Copacabana Beach in 2006. However, Brazilian officials swiftly dismissed any such plans, with similar reactions encountered across Europe. Australia, Singapore, and the Middle East. Listening parties for his new album have left fans disappointed, with Kanai reportedly sulking around the stage, barely performing, and saying very little. The U.S. Sun has also reported on Kanai's plans to purchase large plots of land in France, Portugal, Morocco, Spain, and Italy in a desperate attempt to stage his own shows. Kanai is a superstar and loves to undertake grand, unconventional endeavors, but requests of this nature are simply unfeasible, remarked UNESCO consultant. Imagine staging a show or event at the Colosseum in Rome, or at the Taj Mahal in India, or even at Christ the Redeemer in Rio de Janeiro. It would be utter chaos. These sites are not intended for events of this nature. The U.S. Sun reached out to Kanai's team for a response but received no reply.